This is Sounders fan insider standing outside Highway 99 right here in the beautiful Emerald City. And we got a great event tonight for the Ronald McDonald House Charity and the Puget Sound Corporate Soccer Challenge. And somebody told me that Nate Jaqua, Sebastian Latou, and James Riley are in here with a hot band, the Sonic Funk Orchestra. So come on inside, check it out. talking to James Riley, um, and you're here for the Ronald McDonald House Charity. Thanks, James, for coming. Yeah, no, it's our pleasure. It's uh, definitely a great organization that we're more than uh, happy to be a part of. And what is it that brings you out to, to a lot of these types of events? I know you, you guys do a lot of work in the community. You, you go to several events. I mean, you guys are always out in the community with fans. I know you've done stuff for SCORE Seattle. What brings you out here to Highway 99 tonight? Yeah, I, you know, I definitely think um, being a professional athlete and being on the, you know, the stage that you are, it's definitely positive to, to give back to the community, especially a community that has welcomed us with open arms. So we kind of want to reciprocate that energy and give back as much as we can. Now I know that, that this particular cause is close to your heart. Can you can you tell the fans a little bit about why that is? Yeah, no. Um, my mother was diagnosed with breast cancer when I was a freshman at Wake Forest University. Um, so definitely a shock to hear mom say that for sure. I can definitely remember the day. Um, and so to, to help any charity involving cancer is definitely my pleasure. Is definitely something that hits close to home. Um, luckily she's in remission and, and she's more vibrant than ever. But um, others aren't so fortunate. And uh, you know, especially kids that you know really don't have a choice and you know are struggling with that when they're supposed to be out in the park having fun and playing soccer and you know halftime oranges and squeezes and, and fruit roll-ups at the end of soccer games and things of that sort. So uh, to be here, I mean, it's it's more than. It's, it's more than overwhelming just to be here, but to, for it to go to a great cause is, is fantastic. Tony, you know, you and I have talked out at Sounder Training, and you're very involved in the community. I've seen the work that you do. I've seen you MC events at, at Kells for SCORE Seattle. What brings you out to uh, here tonight? You have employees of the, of the four organizations getting involved in this, Starbucks, Expedia, Boeing, Microsoft playing against each other, so it's recreational. It raises funds for uh, Ronald McDonald House, which is a great idea. Anytime you have that combination of doing something physical, playing the world sport, and raising money for a wonderful organization, I don't know how you top that. So I wanted to be a part of this for at least a few minutes tonight, and then I'll go back to my other job, which, uh, as, which as you know, goes back and forth between American football and, uh, and world football. <laughs> uh, welcome to the first of two great events. Uh, got a great evening planned tonight. The Sounders, as I mentioned, will be here. Maybe they'll bring some people back from that party. Sonic Funk Orchestra is going to play for you uh, in a few minutes here. The auction, and i gotta, I got to tell you a couple of the items on the uh, silent auction list tonight. The auction goes till 8. It's about 6.45, so an hour and 15 minutes more. Just to give you an idea, Boeing, of course, is going to play Microsoft. Expedia against Starbucks in these two big matches on Saturday. Some of the companies involved have, uh, have donated some items. We've got an autographed Matt Hasselbeck football courtesy of Expedia. That's a wonderful item. Xbox 360 Elite autographed by 2009 Sounders FC. In fact, every player autographed the Xbox, and that's courtesy of Microsoft, of course. Uh, let me see. Sounders team autographed ball from Sounders FC, a Barcelona replica jersey from uh, Soccer West, and four club level seats for Saturday's game, June 13th, against San Jose at Quest Field at 7.30. And that's just a few of the items that we have for you tonight. Toby Rawlingson, head of team sales for Soccer West. They, uh, Toby, thanks for putting that auction item in, the Barcelona jersey, very generous of you. Pleasure, chat. Thanks for, thanks for having us here tonight. 
I'm glad to. So this event, it's a charity soccer event to benefit the Ronald McDonald House, and yeah. Soccer West does a lot of community work. Yeah. I'm just wondering, how, how does something like this align with what Soccer West does in the community? Yeah, well, I think it, um, it brings us back to really the grassroots of where Soccer West started. We've been supplying the Northwest with uh, specialist soccer apparel for the last 20 years. Um, and a lot of that success has stemmed from uh, successful associations with the local community. So, um, you know, for us, it gives us a chance to really give something back. Hi, I'm here with Michael Wright and Matt Fitch from the Starbucks soccer team, and I have just a time to spend a few minutes with them. Guys, are you excited to play on Saturday or what? Oh yeah, we're really excited. This is a great event. We're excited to get outside and play a little soccer. Expedia, Microsoft, uh, Boeing. It's just it's going to be great to get out there and play some soccer for sure. And it's a great venue, you know, get to play at Quest Field. I mean, who gets to get to play there? And it's just going to be awesome. We're, I mean, it's going to be a fun time. So we're looking forward to it. 